What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the living room. We're the Octobers, and today we're watching the Ant-Man and the Wasp. So as we learned in the last movie, man, when it was going down with Thanos, Paul Rudd was nowhere to be found. So I guess we're going to figure out what this man was doing. But guys, check it out. The living room is going to be changing because we are moving. So yeah, it's going to be the same old thing, man. It's going to be like our second living room, right? So we're going to set up our little living room area. We're going to be hanging out, watching some movies. Not much will change, uh, especially not us. So yeah, let's go. So let's go. Mommy. Jelly bean. Oh, jelly bean. <laughs> So that's the wasp. It's going to be so boring. I won't be able to keep my eyes. <laughs> I will see you soon. Dang, she's really playing the role, isn't she? <laughs> I wish we could have put down our bags and tucked you back into your bed. But too many lives were at stake. Oh my God. They've already launched. That's cool to see Hank in action. Yeah, this is where he loses her right here. Oh yeah, that's right. In the last movie, Paul Rudd went subatomic, right? And so now he knows it's possible to come back. So I forgot about that. Maybe she can come back. We both knew that if you go that small, you ain't coming, no back. coming back. But my regulator was damaged. Your mother's wasn't. What a tough day to have a damaged regulator. <laughs> I know, hers is flapping. Get it now! Your mother saved thousands of lives that day. MVP, selfless. Gone forever. So she's like a... A microorganism in the quantum realm so she exists in a place where like past the singularity basically where all physics break down as we understand them wasn't coming home so time's different the there so thing that i ever had to do oh that's so sad and then scott showed up look into our house <laughs> <laughs> and when he went to the quantum realm yeah he came back he came back everything changed i started to wonder could your mother still be alive you Good better question. hope well you better hope tom really really slows down because she's hungry <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. been a while right oh no not a quantum tunnel i think it's possible to bring her back paul rudd baby let's go <laughs> paul rudd all right i'm here for it let's go we're in <laughs> oh, this place is a maze breaking into something again as always a Scott Wing special. You ready? I'm ready, Daddy. Oh. Sure. No, any hesitation or fear, we're done. I eat fear for breakfast. Wow. That is super cool. <laughs> Come on. Is that the same little girl? Uh, it might be. Look, they'll show us the way. Anton, which way do we go? Anton, which way do we go? <laughs> There's like, um, what's his name again? Michael Pena. <laughs> Thanks, Anton. Oh, no, lasers! Oh, I think I got lased. <laughs> A secret vault. Tell me you brought the contact lens. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> they went crazy with this. My trophy? It looks like treasure. I want to take it to show and tell. Oh, no, you can't do that. It never leaves the house. It's too important. This is the best birthday present you ever got me. I'm so touched you think I'm the world's greatest grandma. <laughs> <laughs> they had. Oh, no, the fuzz! It's <laughs> I, I think we have way too many security cameras, don't we? No, no, not at all. I mean, because it's a lot of security cameras. I know what he needs. I'm running the company, right? And if we overcourt him, he's going to go somewhere else. I mean, we got to land this bird. Expression is land this fish. No, it, it's land the bird. <laughs> Just like you land the plane. You got to land the plane to be in business. I know it's silly to get hung up on these kinds of things, but I do. How am I going to land a fish? You can't walk. And if it swam up on shore and it battled a hawk, who's going to win? <laughs> <laughs> all right, he's showing now. He's been at home for way too long. <laughs> I'm headed to the office, Scotty. But I feel like I'm, I'm way better. Like my heart is definitely like beating way too hard. My hands are shaking, but I think it's unrelated, you know? <laughs> <laughs> He's only like four inches outside the fence. My foot went through the fence. A flying ant crashed. Hey, you try and entertain a 10 year old when you can't leave the house. <laughs> Close up magic. <laughs> I learned that. This must all seem like a bunch of confusing grown up stuff to you, huh? You can't draw on the walls. Well, your daddy went to Germany and drew on the walls with Captain America, who was allowed to return to the U.S., provided he served two years under house arrest, followed by three years of probation. Okay, sweetie? <laughs> That's not no one's eye doctor I voice. know, just yeah. like that. Thanks, I'm also a youth pastor. Oh. <laughs> you haven't had any contact with Hank Pym or Hope Van Dyne, have you? Associating with them breaks your deal. I haven't talked to Hank or Hope in forever. They hate his guts. <laughs> How'd you do it, Scott? Do what? The car trick. <laughs> <laughs> no shot. You need a warrant. Yeah, actually, they don't. They're on the scene now. Really? Wow. Actually, they don't. <laughs> oh, get on the inside of this. <laughs> wow. Wait, they did some mending for real, didn't they? Thank you. You know what? Give me another one. Oh, <laughs> the double. I had a fun weekend, Daddy. 
Me too, Peanut. But just wait till next weekend. Once I'm out of here, you and I are gonna go paint this town red. We'll have so much ice cream, we'll never stop puking. <laughs> 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 Everyone's so amazed. Like, I, I, look, look at him. We can't leave. Like all the dudes just want to know. Oh, some rock band. <laughs> would you have asked him? Um, no, nah, I would have went home and googled it. <laughs> we had a dream, we I'll be honest though, I'd have to be at home for like a thousand years before I do that by myself. <laughs> Wait, learn magic and make do little karaoke. origami train right. trains. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> I had to do that when I broke my leg. Wrap it up. Well, I just had to leave it out of the bath. If he shrinks to Ant-Man, does that mean his, his ankle brace does too? You know, I don't think he can get the Ant-Man suit on with the ankle brace on, can he? Mm. I'm gonna find you, Jelly Bean. I found you. You always find me, Mommy. The hell? So we entered her consciousness in the past or something. Cause Jelly Beans Hope and Peanuts Cassie, right? Mm -hmm. Hey Hank, it's been a while. I just had a really weird dream. I was back in the quantum realm and I think I saw your wife. And then I was your wife. <laughs> I mean, not, you know, I'm not in a weird <laughs> How weird. <laughs> I'm sorry to bother you. I'm sorry for a lot of things. What a humble phone call. <laughs> what? Things ain't cheap. The flipper. Wouldn't you always think that's Kate? Yo, he just got attacked. I'd be paranoid of everything. <laughs> <laughs> what was eating some pops? Oh, freckles. Another dream. Do you think it was a dream, or is it possible that you really saw my mom down there? I'm not sure. I can't be here. I, ca I can't be here. I'm under house arrest. They won't open while the system's engaged, Scott. <clears throat> what was oh, that? Oh, they're tiny right now. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god that'd be scary <laughs> me home they could show up any second relax as far as your nanny cops know you're still at home <laughs> oh they got the ants <laughs> oh he's eating the fruit loop scotty he's programmed to replicate your daily routine nine hours in bed five hours in front of the tv two hours in the bathroom whatever that's <laughs> you spying on me? We keep tabs on all security threats, all right? And so far, the biggest one we've had is you. Oh my gosh. Too close of a call. It was a matter of national security. The cap needed help. So. Cap? <laughs> America, Captain. That's what we call him. Yeah, Kate. I, I didn't think I'd get caught. You didn't think about a lot of things. We're still running. The house is gone. So is our freedom. I'm sorry. I know you're mad. I'm not looking for an apology, Scott. The only reason why we're even talking is because we need what's in your head. She's so demanding, isn't she? <laughs> she didn't even let him get dressed. <laughs> she made him just come on. Is that the security? Those flies? Hey, it could be. This is the front. They're about to go somewhere really nice, I bet. <laughs> is this where you're living? If uh, you need help or money or something, maybe I can... We're fine. Oh, wow. I wasn't expecting that, but, you know, there you go. They are teched up down there. Oh my gosh. And it's the ants. <laughs> Move it. Like Baba Yaga. John Wick, the boogeyman. You're like the smartest genius I know. Didn't you put some kind of like low jack on your lab? Because if you didn't, we have a variety of affordable options. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta do it when you can, you know? The lab emits radiation. Could we modify a quantum spectrometer and track it? Well, where else can we find that equipment? Micro center. <laughs> Bill Foster. He's an old colleague of my dad's from S.H.I.E.L.D. They had a falling out years ago. You, you seem to have a lot of falling outs with people. <laughs> hey, I'm risking everything by being here. Don't you think we should check? We need to find out who took the lab. Who took it? Um, that thing. Well, I mean, I know that, but who is that? No idea. Who could that be? Looks like someone on Star Wars. Is this a new character or an old character? We'll see. Yeah, a mask. I don't know her. Yo, I don't know, but she kind of looks like she's got food poisoning. It looks like Dune. What? Terrible. <laughs> Awfully portrayed. <laughs> Horrifically directed. Stop. Unbelievably unknown. Stop. Stop it. Oh, wow. And then she's going to... Oh, she can't breathe. That's what it was. She couldn't breathe. It's like Sandy. On SpongeBob. No, I think her organs are turning into mush because she's constantly fluctuating in between the physical and the quantum. Oh. 
No one's going to recognize us. What, because of hats and sunglasses? They only that dude from you. Yeah. The system is interfered Oh, with no, dude. I swear to gosh. I'm going to put myself out there, y'all. Someone in the comments said I look like this guy, and then I hate y'all. <laughs> I have to assure her daily that she doesn't. <laughs> both in and out of phase with multiple parallel realities. <laughs> That's dismissed. I am noticing an unusually high number of glazed eyes out there among you. So <laughs> why don't we call it a few minutes early? That'll be enough for today. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. You may go. Cool professor move right there. It's quantum entanglement between the quantum states of Posner molecules in your brains. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. No, we wasn't. Did you guys just put the word quantum in front of everything? <laughs> <laughs> don't condescend, Hank. You're the one who's on the run from the FBI. All because you had to grow to a size that finally fit your ego. That wasn't me in Germany. It was this idiot. Really? Going that big, it must have been exhausting. I slept for three days straight. You have no idea. Actually, I do. Back in the day, I was Hank's partner on a project called Goliath. Excuse me. Oh. My partner? The only thing more tiring than going that big is putting up with Hank's bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> that was that a real falling out, huh? Yeah. My record? 21 feet. Not bad. You? <laughs> 65 feet. Whoa. Oh. 65. If you two are finished comparing sizes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, they just need to put on the boxing gloves, don't they? Mm -hmm. I fired you. Best decision I ever made. Hank was a terrible partner. <laughs> Sooner or later, he just pushed everyone away. Just the mediocrities. Janet was the only one who could endure him. Watch it, Bill. She paid the price, though, didn't she? Oh, no. Okay, ladies, chill, bro. Sisters, sisters. Mm. Oh, it's woo. Someone must have seen me. Relax. If this is about you, they'd be in your house by now. <laughs> what are you, 15? Come on. We got to go right now. Wait. You might be able to improvise that tracker if you modify the diffraction units on one of your regulators. That could work. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Thank you. Why would they tell him stuff like <laughs> he that? He snatched the door open so quick, though. Oh, my gosh. Paul Rudd. Let's go. Number one. Number one. <laughs> when I say Paul. You say Rudd. Paul. Paul. Rudd. <laughs> I can assure you I'm the last person he would want to visit. Oh, come on. You expect hey, us to... Hey, hey. Why is that? We hate each other's guts. <laughs> Foster, he hasn't had one good idea in his unremarkable career. But his idea about the diffractors could work, right? Fine. One decent idea. Except I eliminated the diffractors when I upgraded the suits. So if we had an old suit, we might be able to track down the lab? Yes, but we don't. Hmm. <laughs> what if we did? Yeah, because why in the world would you destroy it? I mean... Life's funny. Oh, my God. <laughs> you didn't destroy the suit. Well, duh. What? Why would he? It was your life's work, Hank. I couldn't <laughs> destroy that. You sent my suit for the mail. Hey, the Postal Service is very reliable. It's in a very safe place, all right? Don't worry. Want the trophy? No, it's not here. Get away from the plate. I put it back after catching. She took it to show and tell. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Okay, so we're about to go to school. Well, the good news is I know where it is. Oh, he's going to have to go take it from her. <laughs> you know, I like this one a lot more than the first one. Yeah. I'm enjoying it more. <laughs> what is it? It's the new regulator. Hank, what's going on with this suit? He better he better shrink. <laughs> is he like a Barbie size oh right now? Oh, my God. He's about to freak somebody out. <laughs> Come on. What do you see? The sizing coils are malfunctioning. Just let me. Ow! Try that. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, he's like a little boy. <laughs> if only Cap could see you now. <laughs> Hilarious. What are we going to do? <laughs> Where's your hall pass? Hey, I'm talking to you. Run. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Why am Miss Rodwell's? Oh, Where's that's the, the class? class? That's the class she's in. Oh, they in lunch or something? Maybe. He timed that perfect. He's still ridiculously small, though. He looks like a baby walking around. It's not in there. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, peanut. Shrink. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Dude, he looks so goofy. <laughs> <laughs> Hiya, champ. How was school today? <laughs> you want a juice box and some? You need some juice? peanut butter crackers, don't you? <laughs> yeah. Really he said juice box and string cheese. He said, "Do you really have that?" <laughs> Let's see if Foster was right. This has got to be the lab. Or did they <laughs> they triangulated the coordinates? Triangulate. My favorite word. He's every time we go on a walk, he says, "Let's triangulate the." Triangulate the position. Yeah. Whatever. Team me up twice in one day. Makes you think, huh? About what? Germany. What do you mean? We were working together, training together, and you know, other stuffing together. If I'd asked you, would you have come? I guess we'll never know. If I had, you'd have never been caught. 
Easy, Freckles. <laughs> you think you can stop daydreaming about my daughter long enough to get my lab? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting anything on the monitors. Some kind of electronic disturbance. Be careful. You know me, Hank. I'm always careful. Whoa! So weird. They just ran up on her that easy? There's the lab. Oh gosh, she's gonna wake up. It's gonna have an alarm on it. We're sure this is our shrunken building and not somebody else's, right? Just take it, Scott. Come on, we gotta be fast. <laughs> no! Nah, she don't use that How suit. How did she know? Oh my god, and Hank? I don't think they can hear you. Oh. Hi. Hello. I'm Ava. Scott. All right. <laughs> you don't need the suit to uh, go through things. It just helps me control it and the pain. Mm. You're not going to reach into my chest and crush my heart, are you? <laughs> You're funny. I'm not going to hurt you, Scott, unless I have to. I need what's in your head. Easy, little girl. What are you doing? <laughs> She kind of has like Wanda powers and vision. Let's wake up the rest of the gang and get this over with, shall we? Get up. Oh, she's weird, dude. Don't ever touch him again. I think I'm being rather gentle with your father, all things considered. Another casualty of Hank Pym's ego. Whoa, that's a betrayal right there. I mean, like you can see it coming, but like... <laughs> oh man, I thought you were cool. What the hell is going <laughs> on here? Why did you think it was cool? Until my father dare disagree with the great Hank Pym. who had him fired and discredited for good measure. My father tried to continue his research on his own until something went wrong. He told us to run. No! I could tell he was scared. No! I didn't want him to be alone. No! No! When I woke up, my parents were dead. I wasn't so lucky. They call it molecular disequilibrium. Man, so she's jacked up all the way down to the molecular level. Ooh. Every cell in my body is torn apart and stitched back together. Wow. Over and over every day. I was still at S.H.I.E.L.D. when I got the call about a quantum anomaly in Argentina. My name's Bill. Wow, that looks just like him. I brought you something. All right, try again. That's it. Dr. Foster did his best to keep me safe. But others at S.H.I.E.L.D. saw an opportunity in my affliction. They built me a containment suit so I could control my phasing and trained me to be a stealth operative. And in exchange for my soul, they were going to cure me. They lied. I don't really think there's no cure in that, bro. <laughs> right. Her condition was progressive. I didn't know how to cure it. <laughs> she discovered that you were building a tunnel. <laughs> the message from Janet inside his head. Can you tell me who's texting me? Cassie, 911. It's 911. That means it's an emergency. <laughs> okay, look, she's trying to video chat me now. Something might be wrong. Let me talk to her, please. Cassie, are you okay? I can't find my soccer shoes. <laughs> hey, can you just walk the phone around the house? No, I, I can't do that right now. Why not? Because I'm sick. Hey, um, can you just maybe look around later then and call me back? Better! Feel better, buddy! <laughs> For the last 30 years, she's been down there absorbing quantum energy. We can extract that energy. We can use it to repair Ava's molecular structure. Extract it? Yes. Are you insane? That would rip Janet apart. You don't know that. I'm going to fire up your tunnel. When Janet's location pops into Lang's head, he's going to give it to me, or I'm going to turn him over to the FBI. You are going to stay here just in case I need your help. Like hell, I would help you. I bet there's something in the Altoids box. Yeah, 100%. I was thinking that earlier. So help me God. Wait, there ain't no telling it's what he has heart. in thing. He needs his pills, please. Dr. Foster, they're in the tin, please. He could die for... Come on! Help him! Dad, just hang on, all right? Just keep... Help him, man, come on! The Altoid tin. Wait! This is the ants. Let's go. Thanks, guys. I wasn't expecting an ant, so... I'll be honest. <laughs> She's glitch, isn't she? Yeah, I feel bad for her. There's no benefits of that. I think with all this time to prepare, I'd be more ready. Going subatomic isn't something you can prepare for. I mean, seeing my mom again. <laughs> but she's a completely different person. Like, uh, George Washington. I'm serious, Scott. George Jefferson. If she's forgotten about me. When I was in prison, the only thing that got me through was Cassie. I could have been locked up for a hundred years. I never would have forgotten her. I know your mom is counting the minutes until she can see you again. Oh. Or they're quantum minutes, whatever that means. Forgot the motion sensor lights on the back of the building. Maybe I could stop by tomorrow and take a look at it. The meeting's first thing in the morning. You gotta come right now and fix it. You know what? I'm coming to you. I I'll just bring the plans and just tell me where you are, okay? 
They just put it right in the middle of the woods. <laughs> Security of tomorrow? Today. Of the lean in, bro. Keep practicing. Hey, I just got to drive up to Scotty. So you sprung for the undercarriage watch? That's a scam, bro. We live in California, not Minnesota. <laughs> They're budgeting every dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you and why do you know so much about car wash protocol? My name is Sonny Birch. I do my research. Scott Lang, Hank Pym, who I've also learned as a portable shrinking laboratory. And you gonna tell me where it is? I don't know what you're talking about. Well, I sense a resistance in you, Luis. And I have <laughs> promised results to some dangerous people. Usman is a master at extracting information from the unwilling. Mm -mm. Is that some oh, truth serum or something? Serum? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> it's a little concoction that he's been perfecting since his days with the SIS. Dude, that's truth serum. No, it's not. No pissing. <laughs> oh, okay, hey. I believe you. <laughs> <laughs> not to get that lab back. How long have I gone? A couple of weeks, maybe. Dang. Lang. He has a daughter, right? Oh, Lord, they're about to start kidnapping. He won't be a part of anything like that. One who's about to fade away into nothing, Bill. You said you could fix me. You lay one finger on that little girl and we're done. You gotta feel for her, though. She didn't ask for all that. Right. There are other options. Man, she's dangerous. Desperate. The truth serum. You know what? You're right. This isn't truth serum because I don't feel anything. That was a lie. I do feel something. This is truth serum. There's no such <laughs> thing. Okay. He's about to backhand him. I'm gonna make this real easy for you. Okay. Where? It's Scott Lang. Oh, well, see, that's complicated. Oh, God. <laughs> His wife had just filed for divorce, and I was like, damn, homie, she dumped me when you're on lockup. And he was like, yeah, I know. I thought I was going to be with her forever, but now I'm all alone. Damn, homie, you know what? You got to chin up because you'll find a new partner. But you know what? I'm Luis. Hey, hold on, hold on. I like a good story as much as the next person, but what in the hell does this have to do with where Scott Lang is? I'm getting there. I'm getting there. You put a dime in him, you got to let the whole song play out. Oh, my abuelita had a jukebox in the restaurant. Yeah, only played Morrissey. And if anybody ever complained, she'd be like, oh, no te gusta mas? You know, Chicanos, we call them mas. <laughs> so anyway, this guy gets out of jail and he starts working for Hank. That's when he met Hope. And Hope's all like, I want nothing to do with you. Look at my hair, dude. I'm all business. And <laughs> <laughs> and you fast forward and they're all like into each other, right? And then Scotty's like, you know what? I can't tell you this, but I'm gonna go trash in the airport with Captain America. And then she said, I can't believe you split like that. Smell you later, dummy. So <laughs> Scotty goes on house arrest. The heart is all like, damn, I thought Hope could have been my new true partner. But fate brought them back together. And then Hope's heart is all, I'm worried that I can't trust him. <laughs> Company's red and we're days away from going out of business. Oh, out of business. Days away? Damn, truth, sir. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was trying to be a good boss, but we're broke. And the carpet is our last hope. And if we don't show up, we're done. Damn, bro. That's on me. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> Enough. They're the best one. <laughs> Where is Scott Lang? I've been trying to tell you, he's in a tricky spot, emotionally speaking. Emotionally speaking. <laughs> Literally <laughs> speaking. Oh, the woods. The woods? Oh, the <laughs> what do you mean, the woods? The Muir Woods, the second fire road off the Panoramic Highway. For God's sake. Dang, she came at the right time. My children speak it. <laughs> that freak gets Pam's tech, I'm never gonna see it. So what do we do now? It's easier to steal it from the feds and from the boogeyman. Hey, it's me. How'd you like to get a promotion? I got the promotion. location on Pim, Bandai, and Lang. So you're gonna have to take them down now because they ain't gonna be there for long. And when you do, you're gonna get me that lab. Who's he calling? Understood. Who's this? <laughs> no idea. He's gonna do the hard work for us. What are you looking at? Change my tire. <laughs> Sir. Can you not? <laughs> Sorry, sir, but I just got a lead. That looks like Rob Gronkowski. I love leads. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Kinda. Not really. <laughs> as soon as the tunnel's open, let us know if you get anything that could be a part of her message. Yeah, yeah, I will. Okay, then. Here it goes. You know, I'm still pretty impressed they built all that. I know. <laughs> but when you're Hank Prim, I guess you're just like, you got it like that, I guess. Mm -hmm. You got anything? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Ever. <laughs> What's happening? It's shutting down. Maybe our vectors are off. We've gone over them a million times. Know they're right. Well, then what else could it be? I don't know. Scott, what are you doing? Shut, get away from that. I'm sorry, I don't know how much time I have. I need to fix the algorithm. Oh, she's putting it in his head. Oh. Shannon? Yeah, that's awkward, right? It's <laughs> 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 That's not the reunion I'd imagined. It's all so rushed. Where did Paul Rudd go? <laughs> Well, that's useful. Oh, I hope she doesn't give him a kiss. How is this possible? It wasn't a message you put in Scott's head. It was an antenna. Clever girl. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> kind of corny, right? <laughs> yeah. You have to follow my voice. Like tracing a call back to its source. Narrow it to four and six. Too tight, we could miss you. Look at us squabbling again. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> They're just so much smarter than me. They're holding hands though, so like from his perspective though, it's very weird. <laughs> Bullseye. Source lock. It's you. We got it. 
You have to meet me at these exact coordinates in the wasteland beyond the quantum void. It's very dangerous, so be careful. Time and space work very differently down here. You have two hours. After that, the probability fields will shift, and it'll be another century before they align like this again. Man, this pressure. A lot. <laughs> I know you will, Jelly Bean. <laughs> You probably seem so strange coming from him. <laughs> right, she feels so weird internally. <laughs> How do we get up here? He didn't even remember. <laughs> First, you're gonna see all kinds of lights, and it's gonna get really trippy. But then it's gonna turn black and silent. Sorry, right, I have to take this. Hey man, you coming? No, I'm not. But you know what? The ghost is. And you know what? The feds, they know where you are. They give me some truth serum, and then all of a sudden I started talking all honestly. Like I hate the way that you load the dishwasher. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> Who puts a plate on the top rack? Okay? They don't go there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel like such a jerk. You're gonna be really mad. We gotta go now. Ghost knows where we are. So does the FBI. How? I told Luis where we are. You what? I told him to come here so I could help him with the Carapetian proposal. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know how hard it is for ex-cons to find work these days? Jesus, Scott! <laughs> Man, I don't know, bro. That's murder right there. <laughs> it's a big crime, Scott. 90 seconds to close the aperture. It's to depolarize the coils first. I know. I'm really sorry, but I have to go. Can I borrow the suit? <laughs> Gyroscopic stabilizers. I'm just gonna borrow the suit. Uh, I'll come back. Just tell me where you'll be. Don't bother. We'll come and get the suit from you as soon as we found my mom. Scott, just go! I mean, be sympathetic to him, though. <laughs> like, that's your mom, but he's got, like, a whole kid, though. Nice. Scott? Daddy? It's us, buddy. We're here for Cassie's shoes. He must be resting. He must be resting. <laughs> he's such a positive stepdad. Right. Really lives like a pig these days. Daddy? <laughs> <laughs> Spread out. Ken? You people have no shame. Monitor says that he's in the bathroom. Yeah, I'm not buying it. Cassie, let the man get by. But Daddy's super sick. I'll see about that. Oh, Just... she's sticking up for him. He barfed. Like, a lot. What did you She's sticking up for him. Always. Like, a lot, a lot? Yes. Forget it. Move aside. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. What are you doing here? Scott. So, I'm sorry. I'm just really sick. I told you. <laughs> Sometimes you just got to get it out, you know? Sorry. <laughs> I'll start the van. You get the lab. Oh, Whoa. my gosh. <laughs> that was crazy. That sucks, man. I really want them to go get her. I got to see that reunion. Can't they know Thank somebody? <laughs> Hope Van Dyne. You're on yeah, your right. best. This is harassment. Actually, it's not. What does the FBI stand for? <laughs> Forever bothering individuals? <laughs> Doesn't he work for his new cop? Like I just right. got a bowl of malarkey. We got him, sir. Pim and Van Dyne are in custody. Seriously? Sorry, Scott. They're your friends. That's insensitive. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for misjudging you, pal. You should feel great about yourself. Oh, no. He's going to have to go save him. Why is he such a scary Oh, he's ball? still in it. That's why, because he's a thief. Oh, he knows, for the he other knows side. that guy that's like... <laughs> A used car salesman. He got dealt with though. The man down in Pim's lab is gone. Oh my gosh. They said that right beside him. <laughs> <laughs> What's the odds? They're like, they were like, oh no. How does she know the situation so quick? Who told her? Thanks for covering. Bro. She just knew because she saw the ant in there. Right. And what's that view they have? <laughs> so, how long have you been Ant Man again? Not long. It just sort of happened. I'm sorry for lying to you. That is okay. It's not. I do some dumb things, and the people that I love the most pay the price. I know how people listen dumb. Oh, I screw it up just about every time. But maybe you just need someone watching your back, like a partner. Oh, she's made it clear that's about the last thing she wants. Who? <laughs> Hope. Wait, who did you think? Me. Oh. <laughs> Don't laugh. I'd be a great partner. Oh, Peanut. It would be awesome. She just doesn't understand, does she? I would be a terrible dad. Mm -hmm. Have Hope be your partner. She's smart. She reminds me of you. You gonna go help her? I think you should help her. I wish I could, but I don't know how I can help her without hurting you. You can do it. You Aww. can do anything. You are the world's greatest grandma. <laughs> <laughs> that was so cute. Agent, we will see you in an hour. We don't have an hour. You got somewhere else to be? Yeah, actually. Some are very important. Extremely important. Now that's my girl. <laughs> that's that Kate sign. Yeah. Sorry, I keep saying it, guys. Sorry. She's just Kate Dust. If you're if you new seem here, lost, like, you know. Yeah. To shrink that wall. Shrink the wall. Yeah, because she has those little things where you throw. Right. Got any better ideas? No. Mm. 
And I'm not giving up on mom. She'd be so proud of you. Well, they need the lab, right? Great job, Jelly Bean. Huh? How are they going to get the lab or find it? I think they're just trying to do it one step at a time, babe. That'll work. Scott? What are you two just standing around for? We got to go find that lab. What about me? Mm. He's about to look perfect in that. Nah, actually. <laughs> yeah, he, he was. He looks so obvious. Right. Okay. What? Hi. Hi. This is like 50 felonies for you, ma'am. We planning on leaving soon. And are you two going to keep staring at each other until they start shooting at us? Yeah. Yeah, they're out. I'm on my way. Why do they have to have two different groups of people after them? Even though they're working <laughs> together. So is the van. How could this happen? What the dickens? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. How do we find the lab? And put on a new tracker of sorts. Whoa. <laughs> like a video game, huh? I always go a little wide on them turns on those video games. <laughs> <laughs> That's like that old Simpsons game, the hit and run. Hit and run, yeah. Is it ready or not? We can begin the extraction process now. Listen, Ava, this whole thing could be very dangerous. Maybe, maybe we should. Maybe we should what? I've got days until I'm dead. We're doing this, Bill. Energy readings show they have not used the tunnel yet. We don't have much time before mom's location shifts and we lose her. You know, my pep pep always said, if you want to do something right, you make a list. <laughs> His pep pep. <laughs> two, we have to kick out Foster and Ghost. Three, we're gonna have to fight Ghost. That seems like it should be part of two. Which call it, let's call it 2A. <laughs> They're listening to him? I'm going to die. Let me do this, Hope. Let me get her. I think he's right. Sounds risky, Pop. You know, theoretically, he's the one for it, though. <laughs> okay. Some scary movie? Remember, uh, that beloved commercial? What's up? <laughs> I had him follow us. Uh... Oh, the comments from that movie was saying that was from a commercial, the right? Bud Light commercial. Right, or there you go. Keep your eyes peeled, Scotty. Do you want Pez? No. I'd have been like, yep. <laughs> By the way, I love that suit. I wish I had a suit. I would even, I would even like, like a suit with like minimal powers, <laughs> or maybe even just a suit. <laughs> <laughs> Why? What is it? It's them. How do you even fight her? Do you throw, pour like wax on her or water? Honestly, I don't know. I think you just let the clock run out. <laughs> you just avoid her for a couple days. <laughs> Hank. Hank. Dad, what's your status? Foster's taken care of. Suiting up now. What? Let's go, Pops. Just wanted to save Ava. She's facing death or something far more terrible. I'll help you find a cure when I get back. I promise we'll figure something out. I'm gonna vote for you in the next election. Why didn't they just do that forever ago? I'm gonna need you to step back. Because he probably knows he's about to go quantum and never come back. They probably was like, I can't help you actually. I'm gonna dissolve. Bye. I guess it was just too arrogant and self-centered to just come to a proper consensus that better to work together and put two brains together and be friends. All them egos got involved and- And money and- Oh, there she is. Call off the ants. Oh boy. Why are there so many buttons to power everything? Why isn't there just one button that just does everything? I don't, didn't you build that? Right. He's like, click, 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 touch, touch. Yeah. I don't know, right? I just made like one master button. Yeah, but then you, it would be hard to manipulate what's wrong with it when you break it. In case they don't make it. Don't. I don't know. I was thinking they just threw that in for suspense. I can't lose you too. I love you, Hope. Guys, everything's bad over here. Please. You're just letting him get single-handedly beat up. Here he goes. Misdirection. One of the first things they teach you at Online Close-Up Magic University. <laughs> no! Him and those dang card tricks. Fine work, we got it, Scotty. Meet us at the rendezvous point. Okay, on my way. Really? This guy again? Who? I told you our business was over. Change of plans. He's such a pest. And that's funny because they are actually pests. Right, he's like a gnat straight from the swamps of Louisiana, ain't he? Mm -hmm. This music is so good for them. <laughs> So this can't be happening when they know is doing all that mess, right? They're just so unaware. <laughs> no way this town. It's a whole town though, right? They're just not all unaware. That was wild. This has to be like before or something. That on the carriage is filthy. <laughs> I thought they cleaned it. Whoa. Don't worry. I've taken these guys on the scenic route. Wait, what are you? Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you about to fly over that whole thing? <laughs> Oh no. 
Oh no, that was close. That is so cute. They're like a Hot Wheels size. Oh my god, it died! <laughs> it looks so much worse. He just keeps getting smaller, doesn't he? Signal lost. <clears throat> Recalibrating. Ew. I know that <laughs> they're trying to make it seem beautiful and majestic, but that's gross. One of them things latched onto me, I'd be like, what? <laughs> he never said it was so beautiful, Scott. Oh yeah, he likes larva and weird stuff like that because he's like an ant. I mean, I would think it was cool too. Those what are like manatees. Those are, there's, those are, the, there's a name for that, basically. Recalibrating. What? Those larvae. Micro larva. Right larva. Yeah. Quantum larva. Come on. I think he's at the microscopic level, not the quantum level. Those are like microbes, right? Yeah, they're about to suck him up. Yeah, he gets a lot smaller, see? He must have it like that. He can just cue some dang bites. Oh, she shrunk it. That's crazy. They're saying. Well, the 60s were fun, but now I'm paying for it. <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. Whoa. How do you beat her? Because that thing's moving in and out of time or something. It's like, because it's not connected with physical reality. Oh, make a giant Pez. The Hello Kitty cameo. But you know, that could happen in real life, right? That could happen and you could get it on camera and you still wouldn't believe it. You would think it was just edited. No. That was crazy. Get, 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 get the loud! Oh my. Oh, bro, why did you jump out the car? Oh. You're crazy for that. That stuntman got jacked up in real <laughs> life. Did you see that? I hope they make him a toddler again. <laughs> we got you now, Ava. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so unpredictable. Oh. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Not again. He's a junk. Oh my gosh. That catch was crazy. Go, 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 go. Birch got the lab. I'm going after him. This thing's like a dang football. Wait, everyone's fumbling it. Yes. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. He needs to hop on like a skateboard. Like in that movie, We're Back, bro. If you know what We're Back is, just, just let me know. You're really cool if you do. I was going to say it was like on Lord of the Rings with Legolas. Yeah. God, crazy. Look. He's like kneeboarding it. What in the world? Approaching quantum void. He said, right where I want to be. Right, he's breaking through right now. Oh my god, there's not even sound at this level. Nah, because he's past the physical, man. I really hope it says how she survived. I'm coming to you, honey. Like, what'd she eat? What'd she do? Maybe you don't have to eat nothing. Maybe you just have to lick a wall or something. I'm telling you, she's just like, she's become like a timeless entity at this point. Okay. I, I just found it. We can't grow the lab without it. <laughs> yeah, but the van is busted. Use the Hot Wheels rally case. What? Pick a car. Oh, he would pick the one with the flames. The remote. We're missing the remote. You gotta check the van. The Hyundai. <laughs> wow. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> that is huge air for him, though. I'll get the lab. Hi. <laughs> They're so unpredictable too. Like it would suck to fight them. Right. Because you can't see them. They basically turn invisible. <laughs> he says squint. <laughs> I don't know why I waited to get so close to start shooting. Come on. Oh yeah, that's right. It's faulty. This man just walking with a box like that. Does anyone see a southern gentleman carrying a building? <laughs> <laughs> a southern gentleman. <laughs> there oh, you go. You better run. Work. Yes. Oh, hi. Yes. Oh, Whoa. Sorry. Uh, somebody... Hey, come on, man. <laughs> Some hungry birds. Right. Yes. Yes. I was gonna eat it when he's in the air. You're a badass. Yes. <laughs> oh, look at that. Now, more enemies. Right. Right in the water. <laughs> oh, a fish is going to eat him. Oh, no. In three hours. Oh, folks, we barely left the dock, but it looks like we got some company. Oh, no. Oh, they're looking for whales. He said they're down there doing the nasty right now. What the? 
Oh my god. That looks like Aquaman, doesn't it? I would think that was Aquaman. That doesn't belong to you. Let go. No. You better go find that wardrobe if it's there. You think it'll be there? That was so dramatic. Oh, there it is. You look lost, Hank. Are you alright? Oh no. Is it gonna be her? Mm -mm. There she is. It's Janet. Oh, she aged, didn't she? Oh, but she looks great. I don't know what she's been eating. Some quantum food. He said, I've been snacking on every particle I can find. <laughs> Aww. She's like, I know it's beautiful, but it's so hard to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> it moves. And, yeah. It's like a waterbed. <laughs> you know, I hate when you sleep with the TV on. I'll take that every day over this. Let's go home. Is that easy? How did you do that? Oh, they have the vessel. This place, it changes you. Adaptation is part of it, but some of it is evolution. Where she's like, I have six toes now. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, well, what else is different? <laughs> I got the lab. Oh, he's exhausted. He's so big, he's exhausted. Other countries will be looking at that like, ooh, y'all better sign them accords. She's just smiling. <laughs> Wasn't he only 60 before? Something like that. Right. I got the lab. The lab. <gasps> He's too big. Oh, I thought he was gonna run it over. I'm just gonna go to sleep now for five minutes. Oh, y'all better back up. Oh, that's gonna, that's the splash zone. <laughs> oh my. Bro, it's cold outside. Got the arrow last. Okay. Well, he better shrink. He can't, he's so tired. What's she gonna do? I don't know. Maybe use her wasp powers. <gasps> oh, there's a problem right there. Oh, nice what? snag. <laughs> Don't hurt him. Yeah, but she's all right because it went right through her. What? Oh world? my God, <laughs> even the thing. Yeah. <laughs> I had a rolly book bag. I'm not even gonna lie. And that's what it looked like. I didn't, not even gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I did, that was like the most embarrassing year of my life. My mom told me no too, I should have listened. She was like, no Brooke, you know, like a dork Brooke. I know. Son, come on, wake up. Whoa, what's she doing? Taking my man's belt off? She's being Kate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Hey. <laughs> oh, let's go. Where's the remote, Luis? It's, it's probably in there. I guess this is where we say adios, amigo. No, 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 no. <laughs> that was close. Ava. They need to arrest him. Yeah, he's the one that's like a pal with this girl right here. Yeah, he's a co-conspirator is what he is. What if Hank is right? What if this process kills Janet? Well, she will help right now. I'm sorry, we can't do this. We have to find another way. <laughs> Is. How is she just gonna toss Bill like that? No respect, huh? Mm -mm. Yeah, she's about to just finish herself. <gasps> you better toughen up, Janet. She's probably like, I feel so powerful. She's gonna tear mom apart. Yeah, turn it off on her. No! Oh. Nice. Do we win? Hope! Are you okay? Aunt Man and Wash Gen 2, boy. Aww. I can't believe she's back. Mom? Jelly Bean! <laughs> Aww. I missed you so much. I missed you too, Jelly Bean. No more last minute business trips, okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, just don't worry about me. Scott. Job well done, Paul Rudd. <laughs> Yeah, then this girl. Yeah, confirm your kills, people. Oh, she's gonna help her. Oh, she's got some power. Just here with her hand. Mm -hmm. He probably knows a lot about it. 30 years down there. I can feel it. It always hurts. Aw. I think I can help you. What? He's just witnessing. And just like that, good to go. We just needed Janet. <laughs> so she's one of our heroes moving forward, huh? Is she the wasp now? The, the cops are coming. Uh, the, like all of them. What about them? What would they think? Like so many people are in suits. Like what is going on in here? Like right. <laughs> you see, we, we see these guys, they're trying to shoot people. Uh-huh. So, so, so we apprehended them. You're welcome. We traffic <laughs> in stolen technology. And we have killed many, many people. True, sir. He, he's in charge. That's true, I am. I've also <laughs> committed numerous health code violations in my restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they injected him. It is true, sir. We gotta get out of here. That's when you'd be like, Hero Con's over there, guys. I have an idea. Go, go. There he is. Sorry.
sorry, but we got you, man. Come on, it's the end of the line, pal. <laughs> what the heck? Scotty, reduce yourself. There's no one in there. Magic. <laughs> Get the Langs now. Oh, so he's gonna be there again. Well done. Acting like nothing happened. Let's go. Leave me here. We can make it. You said it yourself. I've hurt people, but you haven't. I don't know, man. We can forgive you. I'm not leaving you. Oh, that's like her parent, I guess, because of hers left her. They had to, I guess. Right. Well, you got to feel for her. She didn't ask for none of that. They just ain't about to catch him, are they? Paul he's Rose like the best slick. criminal. My two years up already? <laughs> <laughs> What's it like out there? People still dance? Our food truck's still a thing? Oh, you got away with it this time, Scott, but uh, I'll be seeing you again. Where will you be seeing me again? Like, in general, I'll see, like, the next time you do something bad, I'll <laughs> be there. You'll be watching in that room? To, yeah, to... I thought you were inviting me somewhere. Why would I do this? <laughs> no, I meant to, like, arrest no, you. I, I'll arrest strange. you later again. Take it easy, Jim. Okay. Did you want to grab dinner or something? I mean, because I'm free. <laughs> oh, he likes him like that. Because he's like Ant-Man? Right, yeah. <laughs> He's gonna be like, buddy. <laughs> this dynamic just makes me feel so like hopeful, but <laughs> there's just no shot. It would be an honor to be in business with you as well. Look at he's at his desk. Right, they're gonna keep the business. <laughs> I know that desk sucks. We got Aww. Oh, we got her a house. That's so cool. Oh, I'm glad they found some peace for now. I don't know about that house though, I'm being honest. No, it's where. It's a werewolf's house. No, it's where the house is. So Cassie, what do you wanna be when you grow up? I want to help people like my dad. I wanted to be his partner, but he said he wants you. Oh. <laughs> Daddy! Hold on. Move, get out of here. Oh, oh they're small. <laughs> oh, gross. Oh, they got the laptop outside? Man, them, oh, cause they're... them fans are about to suck up all the dirt. <laughs> That's cool, though. That'd be cool. It would be cool to be the Ant-Man. Good. Now we might have some answers, because where was y'all at? Well, these animations are crazy. I hate to skip them. I know. That's wild. Look how much work they put into it. It's so nice. I used to be a respected scientist, said by name the sides of buildings. Now I got this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think it has flair. Collection unit activates when you decouple it. It should automatically start absorbing quantum healing particles. Also, make sure you stay out of the tardigrade fields. They're cute, but they'll eat you. And don't get sucked into a time vortex. We won't be able to save you. <laughs> he was like, yeah, whatever. Okay, going subatomic in five, four, three, two, one. All right, Scott, this is a mic check. Mic check. One, two. One, two. <laughs> How's everybody doing tonight in the quantum realm? Scott. <laughs> okay. Healing particle secured for our new ghost friend. Great. Preparing for re-entry in five, four, oh, we better work. three. Hello? <laughs> Aha. Very funny. Hank. Bro. Okay. Janet. Nuts. Oh my god. Dude, I totally forgot that we had to deal Guys. with the ramifications of that. Okay, seriously, don't joke around. Guys! That was tough, babe. That, that was, was cool. crazy. That was crazy, bro. Whoa. Okay. I Whoa. thought they were screwing around. That yeah, was cool. That there's like two important things like that that happened. Like Nick Fury sent that message and then he dissolved. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. This is not a test. Oh my gosh. Maybe. It's a question mark. Even people on the last one told us we missed one, and I'm like, bro, how? Really? Yeah, like how? We do it all. Sometimes people are wrong, though. Yeah, sometimes y'all trip it. Sometimes they're thinking we're missing something that's simply not there. By that thing I wear on top of my head. On my head. On my head. Yeah, y'all thought right. we would like Mary Poppins. That we quote that one more. <laughs> Mary Poppins, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> no, we quote. The thing on top of my head. Right, the thing I wear on top of my head. <laughs> yeah, we say that all the time. Ant-Man and the Wasp, baby, you want to break this movie down? You want to tell us all the philosophical underlying meanings that were in this movie and really explain to the audience the deep philosophical meaning of this movie that the average person is just not going to catch up on? No, I'm just going to say I liked it. Um, it was a lot of fun. It's good to know what Paul Rudd was doing during all that chaos. But mostly, it he's was basically just, just it, was la it was a good laugh to have. He's yeah. basically just trying to... um. 
How do I say it? Hook up with Kate. <laughs> Ultimately, I mean, <laughs> yeah, just helping old Kate out. Uh, risking his whole well-being just for an opportunity to date the scientist's daughter. So got the mom back. Super cool. Mm -hmm. Glad to know that she didn't starve down there. Mentally, I don't really know how she's doing. I feel like she would be exhausted and honestly, almost like just someone from like, I don't know, 20,000 years ago at this point, you know, because what you know would what you do? You know what she kind of reminds me of? You know when Gandalf like went off into like that thing for a while? Right. Yeah, kind of. Like it feels like like she had like got all this experience from like going there and like learning all this stuff. It looked boring though. It looked yeah, like it looked I would like lose you my would, mind. Like but she looked... knew so much. She came back and just started hacking the systems like straight up. It was a really fun movie, man. Uh, best was, part of the movie was hands good. down was oh, the sorry. end. Sorry. Oh, you're good. You're good. No, I was just saying it was good. It was like a refresher, a refreshing experience after we just watched like our hearts get torn out of our like right. bodies. So. And the end of this was insane. That that was really cool. Like I was saying, I forgot we had to deal with the ramifications of Thanos getting all the Infinity Stones, snapping his fingers, and doing that. So, um, you know, as soon as I saw them going in there, especially out the back of a van, I was sitting there thinking, "Oh, we're playing with fire." You mm -hmm. know, it's one thing to like take all the precautions in a lab, but I don't know, man. Uh, well, they really weren't. They just dissolved well i know but you know once that happens and you get mom back i'm not going back to the quantum realm but scientists are gonna do it okay are babe, do. where does it go from here how does paul rudd get out of there and also how are they gonna like get another shot to like kill thanos yeah i mean that's a big question uh because that's like a really big picture thing i guess paul rudd gets out of there that's probably gonna have a lot to do on what happens to all the characters that are gone because without those characters i don't think he does get out of there no i think <clears throat> so we watch captain marvel next maybe she has something to do with it oh we watch captain marvel next mm -hmm. a lot of people said this movie sucks um yeah really you guys said that like, which kind of sucks for us because we have to come into it being like oh this one's gonna suck but with that being said maybe it won't suck look a lot of you guys just need to be open-minded okay i know it's a female role okay yeah, i know it's gonna be a female superhero I don't mean that the movie has to suck i'm totally just kidding guys um but yeah you guys said that this movie's bun so if it is uh we're gonna guys we're gonna let I mean, you know the next you know, one's we'll endgame and that one's not buns we hear so yeah but when we do drop this movie man show us some love right do it just for us because you like us a lot just like the video share it all that good stuff man you can hit us up on patreon we got a lot of plans over there we got a lot of stuff we got to do like we said guys we are moving really soon we're gonna be completely set up and we're gonna just keep on pumping out that content and so. i'm gonna be editing game of thrones for youtube so like please go like it thank you guys so much for the support you guys really are the best but y'all already know that it's been the octobers we'll see y'all on the next one